X5, it, when it's installed by a, a dealer for the consumer, it's uh, pretty much he's installing a system that's hidden away in the room. That hidden away aspect uh, really gives you know music in the room, uh, the consumer doesn't look at a, a, a device sitting on a table anywhere, uh, they have access to music by selection off their keypad, they have access through an app, uh, so there's many ways for them to get to the content. One other feature about X5 that we incorporated into it was its ability to, to be able to integrate into a, a video system, if you will. So a master bedroom television set, for example, that TV may have a Blu-ray player, a DVD player attached to it, cable box, satellite receiver, and so on. We did, what, we, what we provided was taking the optical output of that television set or the coax output, the digital out, and feed it into the X5. So that way the X5 becomes the amplification for that video source. Uh, as they select different sources on the television set, that's what the consumer listens to through the X5 itself. Or independently on its own, you could use the streaming content or the, blue, um, the Bluetooth connection that's available for it uh, to, to provide audio in that room. So instantly, consumer turns the TV on, this system comes on, and it comes on to amplify that audio. So there's no um, latency issues between the optical or digital output to the X5. Um, We've passed that, um, and again, that's through all this digital processing that we do to, to the signal uh, to, to ensure that we don't have the latency issues. Um, so part of the audio, the experience in the room is, is that we have a 50 by 2 amplifier. It's very powerful. There's a sub subwoofer output on the X5. As you see here, we have a sub attached to it. Um, so it's intended to give decent, or better than decent, if you will, uh, sound quality in the room itself. Control again in the room. It's app, it's keypad. They can pick up an IR remote and shoot it at the keypad as well. So there's a lot of ways of getting uh, control to it. The other thing we did with X5 is that we uh, built in, um, as part of the control aspect of it, IR codes. So it learns IR codes and there's a pre programmed set of IR codes in the box itself. So when the consumer picks Blu ray, for example, the TV will, the X5 will send an IR code to the television set to pick the Blu ray. Uh, input and send IR code off to the Blu-ray player to cause it to play. So these macros could be set up by the dealer to really give a convenience to the homeowner of play Blu-ray by pressing one button. So a lot of the things that we do on our uh, control systems today that are the home run wired systems we do in the X5. We brought all that to the X5. Um, there's a trigger output to trigger a larger amplifier to turn it on and off. Um, there's a line output that could be set for fixed or variable as well, so that uh, the dealer could take that line output and quite possibly use that as uh, subzoning with a bus product, for example, or feed that line output to uh, a much larger amplifier if they choose to have a larger amp besides the 50 by 2 that's already in there. Um, so all the connections on there are the RJ45 type. There's wired Ethernet connection. There's uh, the uh, wired connection for Bluetooth as well as a wired connection for the keypad.